Thanks. And now, Kiel Nathan. Yeah, thank you. You know, it's unfortunate that the United Nations, as a body that began to protect and empower citizens of the world, has been reduced to a meagre target setter for member states. In next week's conference in New York, heads of member states all across the world will sign 17 development goals with 169 targets. Compare this to the eight millennium goals with 21 targets they signed only 15 years ago. The goals were noble and meaningful, but not achieved. If we have been unable to achieve the eight, what makes anyone think that we can achieve the 17? It's also unfortunate that the UN has decided to focus on the long term rather than place its emphasis on what needs to be done right now. The camps in Lebanon, Jordan and Libya are full of Syrian refugees. They are weakly protected and there is a 59% funding gap so that they need of what they need in order to house these people safely. There is no wonder, therefore, that refugees are forced into a double exodus, first fleeing Syria and then the camps themselves. If the UN are not looking after the refugees in the camps, is there any wonder the people are seeking a better life here in Europe? Thank you.